Are you all right, Harry? I had a bad dream last night. Look at the bright side, Harry. We're going to the Quidditch World Cup. Let's go. I have terrible news. The Quidditch World Cup has been cancelled. Why is it, Minister? There's a stampede going on. Um, Harry! These muggles have no place in our wizarding world! <laughs> Marth Mothra! <sighs> you okay, Harry? Who are those people in black and what's that thing in the sky? They were Death Eaters, the followers of Voldemort, and that thing in the sky is the Dark Mark, Voldemort's Mark. I've seen the man over there, but I didn't see his face. Clear the runway! I have an announcement to make. First, let me introduce you to your new defense against the Dark Horse teacher, Alistair Moody. And second, we have special guests from other schools. Please welcome the lovely ladies of the Bobatons Academy of Magic with their headmistress, Madame Maxime. Jumping jellyfish, that's a really tall giraffe! What did you say? Nothing, ma'am. And now, please greet the proud sons of Durmstrang. And now, Hogwarts has been chosen to host a legendary event, the Triwizard Tournament. The Triwizard Tournament brings three schools together. For each school, a single student is selected to compete. The winner of the tournament must survive three dangerous tasks. That's why you must be at least 17 to compete. Silence! I will cancel the tournament if you don't behave like grown men. Now, let me introduce you to the Goblet of Fire. Anyone wishing to submit themselves to a tournament must write their name on a piece of parchment and throw it into the flame. If chosen, there's no turning back. As from this moment, the Triwizard Tournament has begun! There are three unforgivable curses. The Imperious Curse, the Cruciatus Curse, and the Killing Curse. And apparently, only a single student in this classroom survived the Killing Curse. Now the moment you've all been waiting for, the champion's election. The Durm Strength Champion is Victor Crumb. The Bobatons Champion is Lord Lecur. And the Hogwarts Champion is Cedric Diggory. Yeah, go Cedric! Excellent! We have our three champions, but only one will hoist this vessel of victory, the Triwizard Cup! Psst. Wait, there's a name written here. Harry Potter? HARRY POTTER! I'm out of here. Let's get that cheetah! Harry, did you put your name in the Goblet of Fire? No, I didn't. He's lying. Oh, yes, he is. The Goblet of Fire is an extremely powerful magical object. Only an extremely powerful Kofanda's charm could have hoinked it. I'm afraid he's a Triwizard Champion now. Elves, I suggest you not to let Potter compete. Headmaster, if we try to discover the meaning of these events, perhaps we should let them unfold. I agree with Severus, and Alistair will keep an eye on Harry. He must be anxious knowing what lies ahead. How did you do it? Ron, I did not put my name in that cup. I don't know what happened that night. Shut up. Psst, Ori, Harry, go with me. Where are we going, Hagrid? You'll see, just follow me. Stay here, I'll be back. Bonsoir, Lamp. Oh, Hagrid, I thought you forgot about me. Couldn't forget you. Santa Claus, do you take this woman as your wife? Ignore him, he's an idiot. I just wanted Santa Claus to marry that giraffe! Harry, this is important. The first task will include dragons. Dragons? Is that a joke? Come on, Harry. They are misunderstood creatures. I'm afraid the task won't be easy, but I wish you luck. Thanks, Hagrid. And now, a third and final contestant, Harry Potter! Harry, I'll give you a hand! Hey, Godzilla! Down here! Eat this roasted turkey! I actually mixed the turkey with the sleeping potion! <laughs> Harry Potter successfully catches the golden egg! of the Triwizard Tournament since its inception. The Yule Ball is first and foremost to dance. I better find someone for the Yule Ball. Hi there, Cho. Would you like to go to a ball with me? 
I'm sorry, but someone's already asked me, and I said I'll go with him. Well, that's fine. Harry, I really am sorry. These decorations are really nice, aren't they, Luna? I made them by myself. I also built that giant snowman over there. Hi, everyone. I'm Olaf, and I like warm hugs. That's nice, but we better get ready. The dance is about to start. Bloody hell, Harry! I look ridiculous in these robes! Actually, Ron, you look amazingly traditional. I bet Hermione's crying in her room. Hello, boys. Ready for the dance? Yes, Victor. Hermione, you're not supposed to be with Crump. He's using you. How do you? Besides, I can take care of myself. He's a dumb strength. They get scary when they get older. Your brain IQ is zero instead of 200 for dating the enemy. Ron, you spoiled everything. Hey Harry, if you want to know the hint for a second task, just go to the prefix bathroom and open the egg underwater. Let's see what's the hint. Come seek us where our voices sound. We cannot sing above the ground. An hour you'll have to look to recover what we took. Now I get the hint. Hey Harry, have some gillyweed. You're going to need it for a second task. Alright, I'm going to feed Gary. Well, that was weird. Welcome to the second task. Last night, a treasure was stolen from each of our champions. Each champion will find their treasure and return it to the surface. Let the task begin. I've got my gillyweed. Ah, oh, that's disgusting. I don't feel so good. Yeah, fresh victims. Oh no, you don't. <laughs> Miss Zucker has unfortunately been forced to retire. I'll save me, Cho. Don't worry, it's me, Victor. Ron, I want to save you, but I also need to save this little girl. I'll save you both then. Wait, where are my victims? <laughs> Mr. Dicker is the winner, but Mr. Potter is in second place now for his determination to save the others. You saved my little sister even though she went out far, you do save. Thank you so much. No problem, Fleur. That's what friends do. Congratulations, Potter. Your performance on the Black Lake was inspiring. This is Baratus Serum, an extremely powerful potion that forces the drinker to tell the truth. You and your little friends are brewing Polyjuice Potion, and believe me, I'm going to find out why. Earlier today, Professor Moody plays a Triwizard Cup deep within the maze. Now as Mr. Diggory and Mr. Potter are tied in first place, they will be the first to enter the maze, followed by Mr. Crumb and Ms. Delacour. The first person to touch the cup will be the winner! Champions, prepare yourselves! Let the final task begin! Expelliarmus! Are you alright, Fleur? Crumb attacked me and now he can't feel my leg. I think he's bewitched, but don't worry, they'll get you out of here. Harry, I'm stuck, please help me get out. Thanks for helping me. No problem, it's only a game. Let's get to the cop. Uh, what are we? Oh look, Harry, the cop is a porky. Cedric, we need to get out of here now. What are you talking about? Ah, my scar! Who are you? What do you want? Kill the spare. I'm not a cadabra. No, Cedric! Ah, ah! Ah! The Dark Lords are right again. Welcome, my friends. I confess myself disappointed. Not one of you tried to find me. Oh, Harry, I almost forgot you were here. The boy who lived. I couldn't touch him before because his mother gave her life for her son and provided him the ultimate protection. Love, but that's all magic. Now I can touch you. Ah! Crucio! Ah, ah, ah! I'm going to kill you, Harry Potter. I'm going to destroy you. And after tonight, no one will question my power again. Have it your way, Voldemort! Expelliarmus! At 
Pinocchio! Wait, where did he go? No! Uh, time for plan B. Harry, what happened? He's back! Voldemort's back! I couldn't leave Cedric's body! Merlin's beard, a boy has just been killed! You're coming with me, Potter! Uh, Harry said the Dark Lord is back! I do not believe that! I put your name into the Goblet of Fire, Potter! You won and ended up in the grave tonight because it was meant to be so! Now the Dark Lord will reward me when he learns that I killed Harry Potter! Avada! Expel your miss! Where's Alistair Moody? He's inside the chest! Are you alright, Alistair? I'm sorry, Albus. We'll get you out of there in a minute. If that's Moody, then who's that? Body Crutch Jr. The Dark Lord has returned. I'll be welcome back as a hero. You're the one who stole my apologies potions, not Potter. Let's take him to Azkaban. Cedric Diggory was exceptionally hardworking and a fierce friend. He was murdered by Lord Voldemort. In light of recent events, the bonds of friendship we made this year will be more important than ever. I'm sorry for putting you in terrible danger this year, Harry. Dark and difficult times lie ahead. But remember, you have friends here. You are not alone. Thank you, sir. Everything's going to change now, isn't it? Yes, Hermione. Promise you'll write this summer. You know I won't. I will every week. 